guys, it's Anna. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. Before we get into the video, they are still drilling the pool over here. So I apologize for any extra background noise. Like I said before, I will try to eliminate as much of it as possible in post editing. But in today's video, I'm going to show you my beautiful Christmas tree and my favorite ornaments that I really, really love so much. They are all different. Some of them are Disney, some ornaments I purchased while traveling to Europe, some ornaments just been in my family forever. So before we get into the video, if you're new here, hi, my name is Anna. Right now I am doing a Vlogmas, but my normal content is Disney, traveling, and tips and tricks for you and your family. So if that's something that you might enjoy, please consider subscribing and hitting the bell so you'll be notified every single time I upload a new video. If you enjoy this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. It really helps my channel so much. All right, let me flip the camera and show you some of these gorgeous ornaments. The first two ornaments I'm gonna show you is this snowman and this snow woman, snow girl. My mom gifted them to me. My gosh, maybe like in 2003, 2004, so really, really long time ago. And they are just so beautiful. I absolutely love them. He is just such a cutie pie. I love her so much. So, so cute. This ornament we picked up in Disney World when we were there during the summer. It's really pretty. I don't think this is glass, but I'm sure this is probably pretty breakable, if you ask me. This is a matryoshka, or as you guys might know it, Russian doll. She is from Moscow. I picked her up, my goodness, I don't know, about eight years ago at this point when I was visiting Moscow. Um, she is beautiful. There's so many details and I absolutely love her. This cuckoo clock, it is so beautiful. This one is actually from Disney. It's so delicate, like the glass is so delicate. And this one is from Epcot from the Germany Pavilion and it's a cuckoo clock. And I wanted to get it because my grandma had cuckoo clocks when I was little. And so it kind of reminded me of that. And I just thought it was so beautiful. And I just love it so much. This was the first Disney ornament I've ever purchased. Um, I've been to Disney prior to 2011, but that was the first time I took my oldest son and this was the first ornament we purchased so it's very very special i love it so much new ornament from this year it's chip and dale i absolutely love it it's glass it's beautiful and we do love disney very much I grew up watching disney cartoons and this just reminds me of my childhood it's just so so cute such a cute ornament right here we have a very special I don't even know if you call it an ornament but a memory of our dog who has been gone now for two years so we keep him here with us during the holidays so he's always here we had a basset hound this ornament my son just actually purchased for me at the holiday fair so I thought that was so cute. I really love owls and this one is just a beauty. She is glass and a pretty big ornament, I have to say. Very, very pretty. I also absolutely love polar bears. This one also, I think my mom gifted this to me. It doesn't have a date on it because I do have some ornaments that have dates. But this one is also probably, I want to say like 2004, 2005. Such a pretty ornament. This is Santa. I absolutely love him. He is a huge ornament. I purchased him 
in a store i think that no longer exists lord and taylor they used to have a really beautiful christmas department and they had gorgeous gorgeous ornaments and i used to love going there to buy christmas ornaments because you actually got glass ornaments and just quality ornaments i just feel like it's just getting so hard to find them this ornament is all from sea glass and this one is from Maine. We travel to Maine pretty much every summer. And um, it's just a great memory for us. This is also another favorite. They're all kind of here together. Um, I don't know. I, I don't remember where I got this from. And it, it doesn't look anything like Home Alone Home. But when it's kind of like on the side, I don't know. It just kind of like reminds me of the Home Alone movie and I just love it so much. This is another owl. I think she is a couple years old for sure and I think I purchased her in Pure One. She's very beautiful and sparkly and I love her so much. Here I have another Disney ornament. I think this is from a couple of years ago but it has all of the parks. Many, many years ago when my babies were babies, we went to the Polo Express and I purchased this ornament there. So it's a great memory that we have. I love it. This is an ornament that one of my kids made. I don't know which one, but I cherish this one so much. Sorry, I have stuff on my floors. <laughs> this ornament is so beautiful reminds me of ornaments from back in the day when they were designed like this this was like a set of four but this is the only one that's left and it's also probably good oh my goodness probably like 15 years old at this point i have another owl over there she's so cute this one i bought it this year it's from hobby lobby this is another polar bear I absolutely love her. She's so beautiful. I want to say, now I could be completely wrong, but I want to say that this is from Florida, from all of the places. I think we went to like um, Miami Seaquarium, maybe, or some, some place like that over there, and I think that's where I got her from. She's so beautiful. And then we have Silly Santa. <laughs> from Kennedy Space Center. We went last year with the boys and they had a blast. Here's another polar bear with a snowman. This was also from Lord and Taylor. And this is also probably from 2003, four, five. So another older ornament. This is a new ornament I purchased this year from Home Goods. I believe this is an Italian uh, ornament or the, uh, the artist is from Italy and it's hand painted and it's glass and it's absolutely beautiful. Throughout my tree, you will see these wooden small churches. Um, they're hand painted, they're wooden. Some of them are like Christmas trees, snowman, but most of them are little churches. And I actually purchased this in Moscow and this was purchased at the Cathedral of Christ the Savior. It's is beautiful church and I was so lucky to have found these there because they're just so beautiful. I have more I will show you. This is another one from there. And here's another one. And another one. I'm telling you I have a lot. I saw them, I loved them, and I was like, I have to buy every single one you have. Um, this was for Aiden when he was born. This is another cute one. It reminds me of like, I don't know, old school Disney and old school ornaments. This is another new ornament from this year. It's goofy, super cute. Here are some ornaments that my kids have made throughout the years. Here's the Santa. I feel like I've had him all my life. 
this is another pretty ornament I believe this is either from Michaels or Home Goods. I do love birds as well I have this one I love her now this is also an older ornament Santa I just love it and this one so many great ones this is a basset I think my mom got this also many many years ago this one keeps falling off but I also love mushrooms I think I have two of these and I want to say I also brought this from when I was traveling to Moscow such a cute one love it I have to put it back um, this is a new one one of my kids got it at the holiday fair so very pretty ornament I kind of have to move these around I feel like my kids been rearranging them this one is a pretty ornament I love it and I think this one is yeah 2011 long ago I purchased this this is another form of a Russian doll um, I believe she's also purchased from the church. I used to have a lot of these ornaments, but I think this is the only one I have. Many, many moons ago, if you're familiar with the area of Westchester County in New York, there used to be a store called Treasure Island in the 90s, mid to late 90s is when I started going there and they had the most beautiful Christmas trees and ornaments and this is from there. That store no longer exists, unfortunately. This is another pretty one. I tend to love ornaments like this where it's just a simple bowl ornament and then it's just like hand paint. This is a beautiful ornament. I think I have a few of them. It's such a pretty one little birdhouse I love this my little Andrew just made this for me <laughs> the snowman is missing his his little arms oh, at least one of them but yeah so definitely I can keep going and going but I have a lot of ornaments this one is also beautiful my Disney ornament this one I love so so much another little birdhouse over here I think this one is also from overseas such a pretty one these little birds I definitely got them at Lord and Taylor probably also like a good 15 years ago I have quite a few of them one right here and here but I used to have so many of them. My mom gave me that little angel so many years ago. And this was like when my boys were born, you know, those generic mall ornaments. So yeah, lots of great memories, lots of beautiful ornaments. I still have a lot of ornaments put away, but these are definitely some of my favorites all right guys well that's gonna do it for today hope you enjoyed this video if you did be sure to give this video a big thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already hit the bell so you'll be notified every single time i upload a new video and i'll see you tomorrow bye